Hello everybody. Happy Monday afternoon. Um, hope everybody had a, a great day. It's, you know, fresh start Mondays. Everybody that knows me or have watched any of these know that Monday is my pretty much my favorite day of the week. You kind of get a start over, do over, and um, it was a good day. Went by quickly. I wish we had some sun in the sky here in North Carolina, but we don't. And it's a little chilly. It was about 50 today. Not too bad. Um, of course, you know, in two months when it's 90, I'm going to be complaining that it's too hot. That's human nature, I guess. Um, I hope everybody is taking advantage that feels safe um, for taking the vaccine. I was supposed to get my first shot yesterday. Had a little fever, a little low grade fever. So I couldn't get it. I have to get back in line. Um, but I don't, I don't see it taking a long time. We've, we've got so many appointments open in here in North Carolina. I think it'll be pretty soon when I can get mine. So, Looking kind of forward to that. A little nervous. Um, don't want to be sore and sick, but, you know, I also don't want to get sick and die. So, that's kind of where I'm at on that. Um, hadn't had a lot going, well, I take that back. <laughs> I was going to say, I haven't had a lot going on, y'all. I've had a lot. A lot. Um, move coming up, um, lots of cleaning and organizing, and, um, I think I'm finally down to maybe picking out some paint colors. That's a fun part, um, but been a little overwhelmed, um, for all of you that reached out, a couple days ago, um, I really appreciate you. Um, last week was rough for me, and I don't, I don't even know why. I mean, yes, I have a lot going on, but it it wasn't out of so far out of my normal that it should have put me in such a funk, but it did. And I guess we all just have those times. I nothing to be ashamed of. Um, I'm just usually the helper. So it's really tough for me to ask for help from someone else. And, you know, for y'all that reached out, um, or even if you didn't reach out, even if you just thought about me for a few seconds, I really do appreciate it. Um, it made a really, it made a world of difference. It does make a world of difference to know you're not by yourself. And none of us are. Um, I think maybe the last year has just really put us all in such a singular way of thinking. Um, where we do just feel like we're so alone because we haven't been able to see people. We haven't been able to socialize or um, really do anything. It's, I mean, it, yes, it's good that it's made a lot of us slow down. Um, but at the same time, it's been very isolating. And maybe that's just what it was. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. I have a few therapists on my friends list. So, um, you know, if y'all think I'm cracking, just let me know. I'd appreciate it. Uh, I don't know. I just wanted to jump on here and, and just say thank you. Thank you for being my friends. Thank you for being my family. Um, it means a lot to know that I have people in my corner, no matter what, um, unconditionally. It's always a nice thing. Um, it's 
something that I've, I've been fortunate to have at least a couple people like that in my, in my life, my whole life. Um, even when I felt really alone, I had them. I just didn't, not really take advantage, but you know what I'm saying. I just take for granted. That's a better way of putting it. You just, you take that stuff for granted um, until you really need it. And so you know who you are um, and you, you know who you are in my life right now um, that I could call at 3 a.m. and just want to talk. And I know you would always answer the phone. And I'm so fortunate to have people like that in my life. Um, I just wanted to let you know, like I said, I'm, I'm fine. Um, I wasn't, it wasn't that serious. Um, it was just a little funk. And the happy people that always tend to be happy, um, when, when the down times come, they feel really down, if that makes any sense. Um, so, you know, but, um, on to paint colors and the fun stuff. I can't wait. There's going to be a lot of color. I'm excited. Am I excited to paint the whole house? No, not really. However, <laughs> Um, I am excited to see it done and to see this move over with and, you know, just, just to establish the flat line again where I don't feel like there's a zillion things to do in the next, you know, week or something. So, um, we'll see. Keep your fingers crossed for me. Send out some good juju or thoughts or pray or whatever you do I would appreciate it because I think of all of y'all all day every single day um, and I'm so grateful to have all of you guys so that about does it for me this afternoon I'm trying to think of some things um, that I can talk to you guys about. I'm still thinking on it. Um, instead of just getting on here rambling. I'm sure you don't want to just sit and listen to me ramble for eight and a half minutes. It's my timer. Um, so I'll try to come up with something a little more interesting next time. But um, thank you. I love all you guys. Socially distanced hugs until we can be together again. And then I'm going to give the biggest hugs ever. The biggest and most awkward long hugs ever. And every person that I see, every friend that I see, you're going to get an I love you. Because I love you all. And um, I can't wait to see all of you. And it's, we're coming to the end guys. There's light at the end of the tunnel. So just hang on. Stick with it. Hang in there. We're going to make it. So I love you. Have a wonderful evening. And I will see you very soon.